Be your authentic human self. Feel. What do I mean by that? I mean, allow yourself to go through all of the natural human emotions so that you may process what is toxic and what is positive in your life. If you are angry, boundaries have been crossed or you have let yourself down. If you do not feel that anger and you choose to suppress it, it's going to continue to build because you're going to continue to have those same situations build up to the point of you exploding. Do not turn to the drugs, social media, distractions, friends, bad relationships, foods, alcohol, as a form of suppression. You don't want to hide from your authentic human self. You are not wrong for feeling. You are not wrong for having resentment, anger, excitement. You notice how nobody tells you not to feel happy, unless they're just a miserable old Grinch. They don't tell you not to be excited. They tell you celebrate, oh my God, you're feeling excited about having a baby or I don't know, going into college. Go celebrate. But when you're angry, what do you hear the most? You shouldn't be feeling that way. It wasn't that bad. Positive vibes, oh, let it go. We are taught to suppress the negative, when in reality, every single emotion that comes through you is to tell you where your boundaries are, to tell you what is toxic and what is positive, what is negative, what is positive, what is, what is meant to teach you so that you can elevate, heal, vibrate higher, and move on, or the positive and continue to leave that in your life and a vortex more of it. We're taught at a very young age, you've probably heard this, don't do that, don't say that, you're gonna make dad really angry. When was anger a bad feeling? Anger is telling you something, just like excitement is telling you something, or peace is telling you something. All of these emotions are meant to take you to a healing process, and if you impede that process by constantly taking drugs, it's never gonna make a full freaking circle and you're gonna continue to build up all of those emotions and you're just gonna either depression, anxiety, suicide, drugs, you're gonna find a way to suppress it. That, that depression that's building up is your, is your emotional body screaming to please let me heal, please change something in my life. And we consistently are taught don't feel that. You shouldn't be feeling that. Worry about another person's feelings. Don't do that. We don't want to make them angry. Why? Why? <laughs> if I get to feel that, they're going to feel that. If they have to feel that, I'm going to figure out what it is that I'm doing that's causing that boundary line cross that's causing that anger. Disrespect to yourself or someone disrespecting you is going to cause you to have a little bit of a flare up. You deserve to heal. And I, I need you to understand the very bottom of this is that your feelings are not wrong. Your feelings are not wrong. Your feelings are speaking to you. Feel the anger, the excitement, the anxiety, the depression, the happiness, the peace. The resentment feel it so that you can go oh my god there's a negative piece right here let me pull it out why do I feel like this who did this to me how did it happen and then you get to elevate your feelings are a process don't impede it please you are beautiful with your scars your healing process and your beautiful wings I mean each one of us takes a different path some of us just don't know how to heal healing starts with feeling feel angry and figure out why you're angry you're worth that change and you're worth the healing as you can tell I'm in the graveyard this is my peaceful place there's not a lot of activity from loud alive humans <laughs> I prefer the peace that the dead bring as morbid as that sounds I get to really interact with my kids when I bring them here for a picnic. Yes, judge away, but this is where we go for picnics and it's so peaceful. We get to actually talk and connect, be a part of nature that I really don't feel like you get in the park. 
But anyways, that's a story for another day. Feel your emotions. Write down why you're feeling this way at this minute. You might be angry at this minute while you're watching this show. Show. Yeah, it's pretty much turning into a show. <laughs> watching this video. Write down why you're angry, what happened, who triggered it, and what was going on. You're going to be able to pinpoint where your boundaries are being crossed. Or maybe you've let yourself down. You are worth healing. So feel. You are not wrong for feeling. Feel. Feel. <laughs> no one tells you you're wrong for feeling happy. 